The fishery is on a clay soil which is a naturally fertile substrate for the recruitment of fry. Therefore it's advisable to crop juveniles every single winter because they're so quick to fill into the void created. In contrast, gravel pits are the opposite and that's because the coarse heavy sediment of sand and gravel is quick to drop out of the water column, having minimal influence on the water clarity. The clear nature of the water in gravel pits allows sunlight to penetrate. Rooted weed beds then grow from that lake bed. When rooted weeds grow, the habitat is created for invertebrates that feed on fish eggs and fry. The rooted weeds also steal the nitrates required for the unicellular algal growth that provide food for the newly hatched fry. So in gravel pits, the fry have less food available when they hatch and more predators trying to eat them. Whereas clay soils colour the water very well which minimises the rooted weeds and maximizes the suspended nutrients for fry and, and tiny bioavailable live foods like daphnia and copepods which is why population management is much more critical on clay pits rather than gravel pits <laughs>